everyone, I am Sarah and this is Sarah with Many Thoughts. I have not been on this channel for uh, quite some time. I explained this, oh this is my dog Maggie by the way, she has separation issues so she is in this video because she doesn't want to get off my bed. <laughs> um, this is Sarah with Many Thoughts. I posted this on my blog but I have not written, uh, vlogged or anything in quite some time just because life got ahead of me. Uh, you know, it was summer so I'm out side doing summer things. I got a second job. I got a new job. So it's just been a lot of transition lately. I got a boyfriend. So you know how that works probably. But thank you uh, for being here to watch. I am super excited. I have been thrifting like crazy. Uh, if you've watched some of my previous videos, I love to thrift. I thrift for myself. I thrift to sell. Um, and I have boxes of thrifted uh, items that I got online and I have not opened them yet because I really wanted to do a video of me unboxing them. So I've saved these for about a month until I finally had a free day to do this. As I said earlier, I got a lot of stuff online, uh, specifically Facebook Marketplace. Now, I get a lot of my stuff through Facebook Marketplace. I sell a lot of stuff through Facebook Marketplace. And I had always wanted to do like kind of a random box, like a lot of clothes where I could see the clothes but I'm not exactly sure what I'm getting. And Facebook did a really great offer through the month of October where they covered most shipping. So I got three different hauls three different boxes of thrifted items and I'm finally about to go through them. I honestly don't remember what is supposed to be included in each box so you're going to be finding out with me today. So without further ado, let's open these boxes. Alright, so I just checked out how much this box was. It was $12, and I believe it came with five things, including a set. Um, I got this, I think this set is American Eagle. So I was really excited to get this, so I honestly have not looked at uh, the listing for this in quite some time. So let's see what's in it. So first, I believe... Oh, this is not the set. Okay, these are really cute Christian Maggie... Maggie, you need to lay back on the bed. Get back on the bed. You got you. There you go. Now lay down. Lay down. Yes, good girl. Lay down. Okay. Good girl. Okay, I know you're so excited. Yeah, about all the new clothes. As you can see, Maggie uh, got interested in my box and jumped off the bed and sort of sticking her nose where it doesn't belong, Maggie. All right, well, Maggie's camera privileges were cut because she couldn't stay still and she was too busy trying to smell everything. So I'm going to try on the clothes. So first, don't mind this mix match outfit, but I have these Christian Siriano linen, kind of like beachy pants. They're a little short on me. Um, so I might have to resell these, but they are definitely a really cute option for like lounging by the pool and you don't want to be completely in your bikini or something like that. They're definitely very comfortable, very breathable, so they're definitely a really good find, that's that's for sure. Alright, so this next outfit is the set from American Eagle. It's a very boho outfit. It has um, a flowy skirt, and if you can see, there's these buttons down it until about here, and then it opens up. Is a really fun outfit. Definitely perfect for like a beach vacation somewhere. I'm actually going to Florida next week, so maybe I'll wear this there. I'm very happy with this. Very cute. I'm really excited for this right here. This is a dress by The Limited. It's a really cute mauve kind of color, light pink tannish. And I probably got this thinking I could wear it to work, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. Very cute. For different occasions, could be a nicer dinner or something to work, for work. Ooh, love this, very cute. Okay, I must have thought I was going to go to Florida without actually knowing I was going to Florida because I'm pretty sure everything in this box I'm bringing to Florida with me. Last, we have this exhilaration jumpsuit. It's very fun, very summery, light, flowy, so it's literally perfect for the beach, beachy weather. And it's from Exhilaration, so it's probably from Target or something. And it's literally so cute. I'm really impressed. I also like this bow feature right here. <laughs> 
So I'm really impressed with the $12 box I just opened. Five items, $12, and really good brands, very cute clothes. I can definitely wear them. Up next, you just saw me open a smaller package. I believe this is the first package I actually bought from Facebook Marketplace, and it comes with three things, and it was only $4, so I'm really excited, and I actually have an outfit on. So, these are American Eagle shorts. They fit me really well, I'm not sure if I'll keep them. And then here is a Paper Crane brand top. I've never heard of this of this uh, brand, but it's a very cute top. It reminds me of the gray and white striped linen pants I tried on first, um, but this is definitely a cute top. I don't think that these go together, but that's just what I threw on from this package. And the last thing for my three piece package is this ambiance tube top. Again, I could definitely wear this to Florida. It's very cute, very lightweight. It's just a tube top. I wouldn't wear it with these shorts, but again, that's just what I have on. So I'm again, very impressed with this package I got. And we have one more huge box. So I'm interested to see what's in there. box you just saw me open it was ten dollars I'm really not sure what's in here all it said was it's a lot of women's size small clothes so there's a lot of stuff to go through I'm really excited to open it I'm not going to try everything on because I already see some stuff I'm not too excited about um, but if I do feel compelled to I will put something on so without further ado let's dig in see what's in this box so these are the things these are the pair that I'm very confused about oh they're champions so that's kind of an in-brand but Oh my gosh, are these like, these are like, these were huge in middle school. Do you see the ends of these? They're like, they go right past your knees and you push them up. <laughs> Wait, I might have to try these on. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> so as you can see here, this, this is what I was talking about. You scrunch them up to right below your knee. These were in style in like 2009, 10. <laughs> this is amazing. They are a woman's medium. They are huge on me. <laughs> I have a lot of space in them so I won't be able to use these but hey maybe someone will I am blown away I can't believe I'm wearing a pair of pants like this right now all right I definitely didn't expect that blast from the past so let's see what else is in here oh a pair of wild fable jean shorts these are going not going to fit me I already looked at the size but they're definitely very cute. Wild Fable is an in-style brand right now, especially, well, it's at Target. So it's the main brand at Target right now. People love it. So I can definitely rehome these. Um, they're really cute, kind of like a lighter wash, high-waisted with the rolled hem. They're very cute. So I can't wear them, but I know someone will. So that's good. And here's another pair of shorts. These look like they might be, oh, Genealogy. Has anyone heard of that brand? I haven't, but they're cut off. They don't look... No, they look high-waisted, um, cut off kind of frayed bottoms. I'm not sure about the sizing. I don't see a tag, so that's a big maybe. And more, are these Sophie's? Oh, they're champion. But again, shorts that were in style when I was in middle school. Um, I mean, I still wear these. I'm not making fun of them. I mean, this is what I wear to the gym. So... I, again, I wasn't expecting these, but hey, champions and in brands. <laughs> All right. Oh, here's an, I have so many shorts like these. I have so many like fabric, cotton, like flowy shorts like these. I don't even know what to do with them all. So I'll definitely be reselling these because I, again, just have too many of these kind of shorts to know what to do with. Um, so far, I'm not in love with the items in this box. I know it was obviously a big gamble. I'm not mad, but, um, this is definitely interesting to me. Now what's this? I will say this box smells good. So the person definitely washed them or at least had them folded and washed in their drawer before they sent this stuff off. So I am happy about that. Ooh, an old navy. Okay, people, this is not a size small. This is a large. If they're going to say that a box has all woman size small stuff, why are they giving me mediums and larges? I can't wear this. Well, this is a cardigan, so I mean, I could wear this, but I probably won't. It's really just a navy blue cardigan. Again, smells fine, but <laughs> not what was advertised. 
Um, probably won't be able to sell this and I probably won't wear it because it's kind of old looking. Another cardigan or is it a sweater? Okay, this is a size extra small, small. Um, it's short sleeve. I actually don't really like short sleeve cardigans. They're very weird to me. Um, I guess you could wear it at the beach. Like, okay, I keep saying you could wear things at the beach. I literally wear, like, these shorts and an oversized t-shirt to the beach. But, I mean, celebrities wear normal clothes over their bikinis all the time to the beach. They wear, they'll wear a cardigan laying in the 80 degree sun. I'm not really sure why they do that. But, hey, maybe I can wear this to the beach and feel like a celebrity. <laughs> All right, this is definitely not going to be, I can already tell, this is just a very old, not very cute, medium, again, not a small, medium tank top that I will not wear and no one is going to wear. It's very old, see-through, not cute. I'm confused, why do they say this is a size small when there are multiple si other sizes in this? This, oh, these are another pair of Oh, from, okay, don't know how to say this brand, Shein, Shane, not sure, um, but this is, this is a interesting pair of shorts from there. I think this is my size, unfortunately. I, it doesn't seem like it. I looked at the tag, do not look at the size. Come on, Sarah, get with it. What size is this? It doesn't say? Large. These are large. All right. I'm going to have to say something to this person. I might be too late because I got this like a month ago, but... It's a size small lot. Why are there larges and mediums in here? All right, this looks promising. Is this, what is this? <laughs> I don't know when I would ever wear this. I don't think I have the guts to wear this. It's from Fashion Nova, so it's a nice brand, but this is a two-piece set, like velvet set. We got a, where, like, where would I wear this? It's not a bathing suit, but I wouldn't wear this at lounging. Okay, I'm trying to I'm trying to get this all set up for you guys. It's so it's basically like a velvet bikini top or like bralette, I guess. And it has matching really tiny booty looking shorts. Tag is so, it's so old that the tag isn't existing anymore. I don't really have much to say about that. I'm if I'm being honest. All right, this, this maybe is promising. This looks cute, this looks cute. Let's see, the hanger, size large. So again, sticking with those smalls. Um, this is very cute though. It's a, a halter tie top and a tie back. So, I mean, it's cute. Someone will be able to wear this, not me. I mean, maybe I could if I can tie it tight enough, but I'm not gonna try right now. But hey, this is cute, this is cute, all right. That's, that's one win there. <laughs> um. This is a really ugly scarf from 2008, probably. <laughs> and there's still stuff in here, guys, so it there's time for this to be saved. Um, Victoria's Secret, okay, size small. I think that's why I bought it. It said it had brands like Victoria's Secret and stuff in it, um, but clearly a lot of it is not. Um, is this a dress? Is this, okay, it's a small, like I said. Oh, it looks just like a nice dress. See? Beach cover-up. Beach cover-up. There you go. Look at that. A size small. I can wear it. Nice brand. It's cute. It has like a little tie back feature, if you can see it. Little. It's cute. Yeah, it's a nice color too. So, all right, guys. All right. I can wear that. Neblina by Urban Episode. So, if anyone knows what that brand is, let me know. And this is just a tank top, a white tank top, wearable for sure. I honestly think I knew this was in here because I saw them and I was like, I kind of want them. These are waffle knit, size large, so never mind, can't wear them. Size large pajama pants with breakfast on them. So if anyone is a huge breakfast fan, I've got a pair of pants for you. And if you're a size large. <laughs> Exhilaration, large. Today is going to be awesome. Maybe that goes, oh, this, I guess this goes with the pants, even though honestly, like, what is it, like, it should say today is going to be tasty or something. Awesome? I mean, I don't know, but hey, at least it's positive. We like positivity here. What is this? This looks promising. It is a 
Derek Hart, size small, romper. Okay. All right, I can wear this to Florida. It's a romper. Very cute. I'm not going to try it on because I don't feel like it, but this is cute, people. This is cute. We're, we're happy there. A shirt that says honey on it. Oh, it's champion and has Pooh Bear on the back. If anyone likes Winnie the Pooh, I got a shirt for you. Size medium though. All right, we're getting down to it. Levi's, size medium. I swear I just saw a stain. Oh, it was a fuzz. I'm not seeing a stain. All right, size Levi, medium, so can't wear, but this is actually a pretty cute shirt with the like embroidered detailing on the sleeves. So maybe someone will want it. Again, I can't wear it. Two pieces left, it looks like, oh, three. All right, so what's this? Medium, plain black shirt, no one wants it. I don't want it either. I'm a little bit sad, I'm not gonna lie, but hey, I, I was doing this for fun. I know that you don't always get what you want or what you're hoping. Oh, this looks like a black, is it? Oh, it's a large, again, great. Um, black crop top, like loose fitting shirt. I mean, I could wear that over like a bathing suit or something for sure. And finally, Forever 21, size large, legging. Oh, that, those are not leggings, this is a pencil skirt. All right, well, maybe someone will want this, not me, but there you go. All right, so I just got through three boxes of clothing thrifted from Facebook Marketplace. I had well over 30 items, I think. Um, and for the most part, well, the first two packages, definitely great. The last box, sadly, not a win at all, but it wasn't a lot of money and it was really fun to go through it and record this video. So for anyone who stayed through, thank you for watching. I hope you sympathize with me for some of these things I got. <laughs> um, but yeah, I write about my thrifting on my blog, sourwhitmanythoughts.com. I show it off on my Instagram, sourwhitmanythoughts. And I do have a thrifting account called Shore Thrifts and Flips. Uh, so you might see some of these pieces end up on there. So if you are looking for secondhand items, feel free to check it out. I definitely think my prices are fair because I don't list my things for a price that I wouldn't want to pay. And I'm, I'm frugal with my money, people. So I'm not trying to rip anyone off here. Uh, but anyway, I'll definitely be posting another video soon, another thrifting video, because I have gone a lot. Um, but yeah, I hope you had fun and I will see you hopefully soon.